Hi guys, happy Sunday. I'm so glad you're joining me. We're gonna go ahead and get started with the sweet and sour. So share with someone around you the sweetest part of your week in something a little sour. Great job. So today's story is about the walk to Emmaus. Cleopas's walk was with two friends, one of them being Jesus without him knowing it. So we are going to read together from our storybook Bible, Luke 24, verses 13 through 35. Are you ready? Okay. On Sunday, Cleopas and his friend were walking from Jerusalem to Emmaus. They were talking about what had happened in Jerusalem. As they walked, a stranger began walking with them. What are you talking about? asked the stranger. Cleopas said sadly, we were talking about Jesus. Jesus was a man of God. He was killed three days ago. Cleopas continued, This morning the women went to Jesus' tomb, but Jesus was not there. Angels told them that Jesus is alive. Peter went to the tomb, and he did not find Jesus either. The stranger asked, Why can't you believe what the prophet said? The stranger began explaining all the things that were written by the prophets. When they got to Emmaus, Cleopas and his friend invited the stranger to stay and eat with them. When dinner was ready, they all sat down to eat. The stranger took the bread, broke it, and blessed it. Then he gave each person some bread. When the stranger did this, Cleopas and his friend recognized him. It was Jesus. As soon as they recognized Jesus, he disappeared. The friends got up quickly and returned to Jerusalem to find the other disciples. They told the disciples, the Lord really has risen. So the two men recognized Jesus when he served them bread at dinner, and they remembered that Jesus served others. So my question for you is, how do you serve others? So you can pause this video or you can talk about it after the video with your family, but how do you serve others? Okay, before we go today, I thought we could play a game. It's called Who Am I? So I need you to gather some pieces of paper around your house and you are going to write down names of people that you know. So one person will pick up a piece of paper with the name written on it and they're not going to look at the name. So when they get their piece of paper, they're going to put it up to their forehead. See, I don't know what this says. And your job is to act out the person that I am holding. So my job will then be to guess who I'm holding. So for some of you guys, you could write down grandpa. I wrote down this one, the family cat. Imagine acting out being the family cat. How funny would that be? Or you could be dad. Imagine that, what, what funny things does your dad say? Or mom, you could be mom, you could be auntie, you could be sister or brother, you could be a friend. I want you to play this game and see how many people you know, how fun will that be? Okay, so before we go, let's pray. Dear God, thank you for this day and thank you for how you walk with us. And thank you for how you give us bread, and that represents Jesus' body for us. We love you so much. Amen. I hope you guys have the best Sunday. I will see you very soon. Bye, guys.